I'm Cheryl Nestro from Tutu Interiors, and I look forward to showing you our newly built out lower level. Come on in and let me show you the inside. When designing this space, it was really important to me to have some separate spaces. I wanted to have a family area where we could watch TV and sports, and then, you know, the dining space to be a separate space so that we could listen to music there. You know, when, I, when we are entertaining and I have people over, this is the space, this is our dance floor. We had so much fun last Christmas. Um, it was one of the first holidays that we all got together after the pandemic. So much fun, we had a blast. For this space, I want it to look like a bar, but it really is a cook's kitchen. I come from a family of chefs. My two nieces are chefs. Started with my mom, she was a fabulous cook. And we all hang out here and have cocktails and make pizza and we have a great time. Oftentimes in lower levels, they can be dark and dreary. This is absolutely the opposite. I have some indirect lighting uh, over by the bar and underneath the island, and I have some super interesting light fixtures that I always think add interest to a space. This space was super important to me. I love to cook and I love to entertain. I want my guests to be super comfortable, so whenever they sit and we're eating and I ask them, are you guys good? And they look at me and say, oh my God, I'm so comfortable I could sleep here. To me, that's the ultimate compliment. I wanted something special for this space other than using the classic artwork. So I commissioned Steve Petra from Petra Studios in Royal Oak to help my vision come to reality. And this is copper metal um, with a patina finish on it. And I started out with twisting some small papers to show him what I wanted and it came to life. I love to use wallpaper as art. I do that a lot with my clients, and this is exactly what I did in choosing this Holly Hunt wallpaper. I thought it was a great visual and something different rather than just having the traditional artwork. I use room dividers a lot, and I thought this was the perfect opportunity. We wanted a large storage space, so we also wanted to have a treadmill. So this room divider is actually hiding the treadmill. I didn't want to have the classic large gym with glass doors. So room dividers, I think, always create some really fantastic interest and in kind of peeking through. You don't really know what's on the other side, which is intriguing to me. I chose a vanity with a trough sink that is installed on a linen wall that has a linen texture. The floor tile is a honed porcelain that has a cement look to it. And we have a heated floor for cold winters. We added a shower with a beautiful dark brown suede porcelain tile as an accent to add a touch of sophistication to the space. I hope you enjoyed the space. Thanks for coming by.